Mm-hmm. Uh, what does it really mean to do investigative journalism, sir? Because hindi ba journalism in itself? You do research, de ba? Um, you do you talk to a lot of people, right? What makes it different if you're investigating a specific topic or a genre? Hmm. Well, tama ka, no? In a way, investigative journalism uh, is a redundancy. <laughs> Kasi <laughs> all of journalism should be investigative. Um, yeah. But yeah. Um, uh, unfortunately, what passes for a lot of journalism these days is less than investigative. Meaning, um, kulang sa research, um, kulang sa points of view, yeah. Uh, kulang sa depth, no? So all of those are implied, no? When you say investigative journalism. So um, you know, I mean the word investigate naman um it's just research, um yeah. a a deep kind of inquiry uh in pursuit of facts. But siguro when you when you apply the word to journalism, no? Uh you're you're you have a particular uh, subject that you're investigating. Yeah. And usually, uh, what you're investigating are people uh, in power, uh, institutions that have power, and you are um, trying to uh, hold them to account, no? trying to make them accountable uh, by, uh, number one, making sure that they're complying with standards and the laws and um, with what is ethical uh, and um, which which could include uncovering wrongdoing and you're yeah. doing this on uh, you know on the on behalf of the public for the public and in the public interest no? so uh, another way of another way of putting it as as one colleague uh, put it no it's it investigative journalism is the journalism of outrage no we're just out, <laughs> okay. we're just outraged okay. we're just outraged by by certain things that are happening in society you know injustice uh, lying uh, corruption yeah. etc and we're driven by outrage without showing it diba without yeah. um showing that emotion on our sleeves no so a motivation natin is kasi if you're not motivated to do this uh it's very difficult to do it. you probably won't do it exactly and any motivation mo well one uh you know you want to serve the public but very often uh, a lot of journalists who pursue investigative journalism uh are mad you know we're mad at at um uh the wrongs that are being done to the public mm. to society to the marginalized to the poor to the weak uh, etc no yeah. so journalists historically have been on the side of the the weak the afflicted no may may kasabihan yes. nga eh ang ang yes. trabaho namin is to comfort the afflicted and afflict yeah. the comfortable no so yeah 